Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. No one's going to brand us heroes or villains. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. That ends now. Contact! Uh, 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 
They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. My hand, Bell. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Do you have an update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah. After capturing Kasim Javadi, we've convinced him he's better off working for us rather than against us. The death of Arash Kadavar opens a path for Kasim to take control of their network. He'll give us deeper insight into Soviet activity in the Middle East. And with our resources behind him, he should be able to influence regional affairs for years to come. What about Anton Volkov? Volkov has become a prime source of information since his capture. After interrogating him, MI6 quickly established a series of listening posts in East Berlin. They've already intercepted messages from the KGB to assets throughout the city. We're poking holes in the Iron Curtain. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Agent Azale's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to his family and his caskets in transit to Tel Aviv. As you know, Helen Park returned to London. She'll continue to recover from her injuries there. Afterwards, MI6 plans to give her a task force dedicated to finding Perseus. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovesky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. It'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. Not anymore. We took down that son of a bitch Aldrich, as well as his key assets here in the States. It'll take Perseus a while to recover from this one. What about Europe? Not only did we stop a nuclear attack, we managed to take out Major Vadim Rudnik. 
That should be a significant blow to Perseus's European network. We also flushed all of Rudnik's key assets down the shitter. Maybe someday Perseus can join him. Hudson, you're the Shakespeare of Langley. And Bell. Arctic air. Clears the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision of your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me, it was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that kid. Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. This is your chance to define who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovetsky. Solovetsky. Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. There's still one of us. Adler. Right. Yeah? Dr. We'll leave within the hour. Five years ago, NATO intelligence detected a powerful signal of unknown origin. The new signal created radio disruptions worldwide. Not to mention all kinds of conspiracy theories. NATO quickly tracked it to this facility in the Soviet Republic of Ukraine, the Duga Radar Array. It's an over-the-horizon radar system. Big improvement over their old missile defense tech. It uses a lot of juice. Could be used to broadcast any kind of long-range signal they want. Like detonation codes to every green light nuke in Europe. Where exactly is this thing? About 60 miles north of Kiev, between the cities of Pripyat and Chernobyl. It's nothing but thick forest for miles around. A perfect hiding spot for Perseus. We'll have to drop you in a little further out. No recon, no heavy support. Just a light infiltration squad. Shouldn't be a problem. Just point the way. Bell came through for us in the nick of time. I never doubted it. Adler, still seeing no activity from our side. Same. I haven't seen shit. All right. Everyone converge on the gate. Sure, you're not forgetting something, Bell. There's nothing here. This can't be the right place. We didn't see anything on our side either. It's him. Fucking lied to us. That true, Bell? You pull us out to the middle of nowhere, Russia, so Perseus can detonate those nukes. I had no other choice but to trust you. What a waste. You actually could have done something with yourself, kid. Those nukes were for defense, not offense. You don't recognize the difference? I'd let you walk back to Perseus, but I think I'll spare you the regret instead.
Apparently, we didn't do a good enough job. Time's up, kid. Cat becomes the mouse. Glad to see you still care. Mind giving me a light? <coughs> I'd offer you a cigarette, but you don't smoke anymore. We tried to help you with all your worst qualities. <coughs> I guess science still has its limits. Please, just shut him up. Don't you? Solovetsky, stand by for the detonation order. I think you deserve this moment, comrade. I wish we could return to Solovetsky to watch it all unfold. That chapter is closed now. We begin the next one together. You did well. And to think, after all this time, they still believe I'm Perseus. <laughs> As if Perseus could ever be an individual working alone. So American. Ah. We'll need a new home now. The Central Committee will be more surprised than the CIA. Even if we made the best choice for the future of our homeland. Mm, yet, for humanity, their eyes will be as clouded as ours once were. Come. There is still much to be done.
My God. How many green light nukes did he detonate? All of them, Mr. President. Does anyone know the bombs were ours? Materials related to Operation Greenlight were anonymously released an hour ago, presumably by Perseus. Calls are beginning to come in from across the globe. That son of a bitch. You and Vice President Bush are to be moved to secure locations immediately. I want any business related to this thing erased forever. Everything. Can you make that happen? Of course. It's already begun. Watch Europe burn. We will watch the Empire of the United States collapse under its own weight. A world with two superpowers will become a world with one. The Soviet Union. And if the leaders of this new world order squander the opportunity we have provided them, and they too will be replaced. Kasim Javali, he fell into the hands of your former CIA friends. Kasim is too soft. I will need you to personally supervise his erasure. As with Kasim, the CIA is now holding Anton Volkov. If you can locate him, bring him back to us. If they have broken him, he must be eliminated. You say that Eliezer Azoulay perished in Cuba. We will not miss that one. His interference with our Middle East assets will be a distraction no more. As for the rest, it was a pleasure eliminating them by your side. Even though we have prevailed, the CIA has significantly wounded our foundation inside the U.S. Robert Aldrich has been killed, and our network there has collapsed. It could take us years to regain the footing we have lost. The death of Major Vadim Rudnik is a terrible loss for post-nuclear Europe. He was to help shepherd in the Soviet-aligned future. Hopefully, we can still move forward without his presence there. The CIA also managed to eliminate all three of Rudnik's key assets. We have no one else to help fill the void. Inserting new agents into such influential positions will take years. But have no doubt, these are but temporary losses. We are just getting started, my friend. <laughs> 